Hello everybody, today we are here in another episode of our channel, Talking with Pamela in this case. Well, I want to talk about something important in what is happening in the, in the world in these days. The whole information I'm going to tell you about this specific topic, I took the whole information about, about that in a newspaper of United Kingdom. As you already know, uh, I'm, I live in Costa Rica, but I have to, to make a research about something that we are doing these days. It is work from home. What do you think about it? I, I met a lot of people that know that it's something better. They can improve their time with their family, they can improve or or their their weight because they are um eating less, they are doing more workout or something like that. But I know and I met some people that they said is something awful. Why? Because you can you can feel stress, you can feel anxiety, you you I think you can you can lost your communication skills with another people because now you are in front of your computer talking with people or doing doing the things you have to do and that's something boring that some we need to talk with people we need to to have friends we need to we talk with co-workers and that kind of of uh, things now i'm going to to show you a little bit about what i want to talk okay how long-term home working can affect your finances as I told you, my inform the information I get was in the independent newspaper. It was in this newspaper is in United Kingdom. Well, we know that nowadays work from home is something common, but more it is more common since the pan the pandemic became. Why that? Because now we need to to try to to let to to do less uh, talking with people face to face. To do less face to face with people, and even if you are working or you are studying, as I, in my case, I'm studying. I need to to be in front of the computer the whole day, and for me, it's something that I. I know that it is good in some specific ways, but not in the whole ways in your life. Well, something important to understand is how the employees want to increase this way to, to work. Um, maybe for the companies, it is a simple way to improve the employer, employer's skill, employees' skills. Um, they can think it will be more relaxed, and have more time to spend with family and well now we 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 know that return to the to the office will never be the same at least not as we did before the pandemic mm, okay look at these numbers the the employers are saying that before the pandemic people working from home were just 18 percent and now after that now they can imagine that after the the, the crisis it will rise at 37 percent and also they think the proportion of a staff who work from home Full time will rise 20, 20, 22 percent post pandemic, 
compared with the 9% before the quarantine. As I was saying before, work from home could have some benefits. You can spend time with your family. You can less wait because you are cooking in your home. You can save money because you are in travel to the to the company or to a job uh, place. And well, you, now you can go to to walk with your dog in the break. But it, it could have some risks, loneliness, less communication. And we know when you go to the office, you can talk with your co-workers. And that's amazing because you are improving your mood and your communication skills. But what about money? Okay, as I said before, um, we can think we aren't spending more money because we don't have to travel until the, until the company. We are in spare money in food because you are cooking at home and those things. But actually, we are spending more money in electricity bills, improving our internet services to have a better connection and those things. Something is interesting is that if your bills increase, you can talk with your boss. Um, because, well, it, it just happened if your bills increase because your, your boss sent you to, to, to work from home because they want it. Because it will be better for the company or it will be better for you. But it, it is when your, your boss sends you. Now you can talk with him and you can negotiate the payment of the extra amount in your bills. But if, if really you ask for the opportunity to home working, you have to carry the whole new amount in your bills. Um, the other thing is to check the insurance first. For example, um, if you have to, to buy a new computer, new printer, new share, um, and that stuff, you have to think twice. Be twice before to get the job. That because it could have to, to be covered by your home insurance. But if the stuff is provided uh, by your employer, the insurance should protect the stuff. And the last important thing to mention is how one women can improve their working from home. It because they can take care of their children and don't need to pay someone else to do it. So it has the good things and also the bad things. For me, it's, it's not just about finances, it is talking about mental health, talking about uh, relationships, friendships, and any kind of relationship you, you, you could have in your job or something like that. Um, the most part of time in your home, you are alone, and it is something that we, we can find different and complicated. Well, what do you think about it? I, I want to ask you this and I want to, I, if, I would like if you can ask me that question in, in our comments, because I think work from home is a good way for a company, but maybe not at all for a, for a person or employees. Um, just if they have these kind of things that they have to take care of children, if they have to to take care of their home, I don't know. 
Something that I read in the in the notice in the newspaper was about how can, for example, now you can you have to live near to your company, but if you are working from home, you have to you you can have a house away to the company and maybe 57 miles or something like that and that's something that you you can do and it could be bad for the i don't know the correct word in english for the people that are buying buying houses in the, in their in their urban in urban place but now um it's it's something amazing you can live in a real place and and you can you can have a, a better or a good job and that's beautiful please um ask my question by comments and tell me what do you think about it what do you think what are the most common benefits or what are your benefits how can you improve your you your skills working from home or if you prefer work at the company and have that kind of contact face to face with your co-workers with your boss or if you prefer this kind of of things like video calls tell me and remember like the in the, like the video and follow me bye bye and see you in the next video with another interesting topic